In this video, we're going to look at finding the integral of 6x times the square root of x plus 1 dx using the substitution u equals the square root of x plus 1. Now, if I was just posed this uh, question um, without being given the substitution, this is not the substitution I would have picked. I would have picked u is equal to x plus 1. Um, this is easier to differentiate, uh, easier to deal with, uh, with the whole rearrangement as you go through, but we've got to work with the substitution that we're given. So we're going to start off with this u is equal to the square root of x plus 1. So I'm going to write it as u equals x plus 1 to the half. So then we have to differentiate our substitution. So du by dx. So via the chain rule here, we would have to have one half. Uh, the derivative of the inside is just one. X plus one to the minus a half. Now we need to rearrange this to get dx equals. Now it's not in a very nice format to immediately be able to see how to rearrange this. So I'm just going to rewrite it in another form just so it makes it easier for people to see how this works so you've got one half times one over x plus one to the half which is one over two x plus one to the half so this line to this line these are both exactly the same it's just written in another format and once it's written like that it's easier to see how we're going to rearrange this so i'm going to multiply both sides by the two x plus one to the half like that and i'm going to multiply both sides by dx so i'll have du left on the left hand side and i've got one times dx on the right hand side so we now have a replacement for the dx and we have a replacement for the x plus one to the half but we don't have a replacement for the x so that is the next thing i need to do now in order to deal with that i'm going to go back to the substitution and rearrange that to get x equals so if you square both sides, we're going to get u squared is equal to x plus 1. And then rearrange that to get x is equal to u squared minus 1. So we now have a replacement for the x. So we should have everything now sorted. So we have the integral of 6 times x, which is the u squared minus 1 times by the square root of x plus 1, which is u, times by what we've replaced the dx with, which is the 2x plus 1 to the half du, right? But now the x plus 1 to the half, remember, is equal to u. So we can actually replace uh, this with 2u du. So let's do that to you du so what we want to do is really simplify what i've got here in my square bracket before i do anything else so we've got the integral of so i'm going to open up a bracket here we've got six times u squared times u times two u okay so we've got six times two so that'd be 12 You've got the u squared times u times u, which is u to the 4. Then I've got to, so that's expanding the uh, u squared part. So now it's the minus 1. So 6 times minus 1 times u times 2u. So I'll have take away 12u squared. So that is expanding that. Now we can integrate. So adding 1 to the power. And dividing, oh, I've gone for x for some reason. Apologies. So 12u to the 5 over 5. Take away 12u cubed over 3 plus constant of integration. So let's just simplify that to write as 12 fifths u to the 5. Take away 12 thirds is 4, so 4u cubed plus c. But now we need to put, put our substitution back in. So uh, let's do that with yellow. So we've got 12 fifths. And the u is x plus 1 to the half, remember. So that is now to the power of 5. Take away 4, lots of x plus 1 to the half. 
cubed plus C. And so our final answer should be 12 fifths X plus 1 to the 5 halves. Take away 4 X plus 1 to the 3 halves plus C. And then we are done.